We're back with some more Sly 2 Band of Homies. I gotta say though, Sly rocked being in a talk uh in a tux. Tux Sly, we need it. Right. Chapter 3. Predator awakes. Someone's not happy. It took some detective work, but the gang and I managed to track down where Rajan had gone into hiding. Some managed to transform a long forgotten temple into the thriving ice operation, and it's there where we'll find him. The jungle, too thick to drive, forced us to walk the long distance to our target. We ran into a few problems along the way, but pushed on. For the temple was more than just Rajan's hideout. It was also home to the Clockwork Heart. A pump so strong and tireless, it could ice production tenfold. Good for Rajan, but awful for the rest of the world. Hope he's not counting on that heart too much, because tonight, it comes home with me. Protagonist and friendos is in The Predator Awakened. Alright, cool. Yeah, like I said, there's nothing I can do about the video skipping. There is just emulation. It's just weird that the first game was like a lot more stable, and then this one's like, not so. Oh, and guys, remember, guess what? Wait for it, I'm looking around. There's gotta be bottles somewhere. <laughs> yeah, like I said, uh, in the past, I will go about them on my own time, so I'm not boring you. Uh, where the hell? Okay, where? Snake, man. Of course, got more fucking security everywhere. Hey, look, there's one. Well, I see it, so why don't I just go get it, okay? I love how they were so notorious in the first game, and now they're just like in the hub of whatever chapter you're in, and that's all you need, and that's that's fair. That's I. I would rather that, but it's just, this place is so big and it takes me forever to find them. Alright, that's three. That's a good start. All right, like I said, I'll do them on my own time, so I'm not boring you, and trust me, I could do it forever. Nice work, Bentley. I'll take a hidden passage over the front door any day. So we go into tunnel. Got it. Yeah, you go ahead. Get lost. What kind of hell is this? Lego, you found a spice growing facility. Now, from what I know of photosynthesis, all the expensive equipment should be found at the top of this room. That access tube should get you up there. All right, I'll head for the top. Right into the water. Join your friends. Well, well, you're still dead anyway. That's all that matters. Ugh, 
That's all you got? Come on, you broke bitch. Oh, don't tell me he's coming over here. Let's go. Oh, you also got some money. Give me. I need. Give me. I need. God pen. Nice. Dead. Uh, interesting. Although, is that really safe? Because that just goes right in the water. Some of the vines around here are really slippery. Jump and hit the circle button to go for a ride. Yeah, we're Jet Set Radioing. Remember when I did that playthrough? That was fun. Only OGs remember. <laughs> Here we go. Time for a few recon photos. Looks like half of the heart is being used to super irrigate the spice plants. Come on. Check it out. Rajan's carrying half the clockwork heart on that stick. Only makes sense that there's another chapter involving him because we never actually beat him. Mm, that crane is keeping half of the heart suspended. No fucking shit. We did the thing. Oh, more cutscene. Think it's gonna get cut. The clockwork heart is under some steep security. Heck, Rajan is carrying half of it at all times. To get at the goods, I'll need to gather some more information. Sly will plant a bug in Rajan's office while I lift the spice operation blueprints off the spice while he makes his rounds. Unfortunately, while we're collecting intelligence on him, he'll be collecting data with an elephant-driven satellite array. Take it out, or he'll be able to intercept all of our operations. God, again, I'm sorry for all the uh, audio getting cut. There's nothing I can do. Actually, hang on. Before I go in, before I go further. Oh my fucking god. 750. Throw an object to explode an impact. You don't have enough coin. Oh well, yeah. Uh, roll through the level silently. Oh my god, dude. Alright, well. Uh, we already had to play this journal, man. Or. I don't mind playing as Bentley, but like, no. If I can avoid it, so I, I just don't like the way he plays. Yeah, here. Rajan is able to monitor all of our communications out here with that elephant-driven satellite array. That's pretty grim. You got a plan for shutting it down? Don't I always? Now, the local spice plants are illegal for good reason. Eat too many, and you'll go into a fit of uncontrolled rage. Keep that stuff away from Murray. Oh, wait, wait, I get it. I put some spice plants in the elephant's feed bag. He chows down, gets all crazy, and then presto, the satellite's in pieces. A crude interpretation of the plan, but accurate. The trick here is harvesting the spice plants. You'll have to do some serious climbing as they only grow high up in the jungle canopy. 
Oh, fun. And I'm assuming I can't just, you know, get up there with ease. No, of course not. But, you know, you say crude interpretation, but I say it's more of a uh, direct translation from your nonsensical bullshit. You're lucky you're adorable sometimes. question is, where would the rest be? Why is this teetering back and forth? That's kind of disorienting. Case in point. And whoa. What the hell? Bug? Bug. How in the fuck am I supposed to get over there? There's nothing for me to... Oh, there's a bounty. Oh, okay. So, next one is where? Back over yonder. Oh, fun. Man, this is a real annoying fetch quest. Okay, that that was really annoying. Why? Now take all the spice plants you collected to the elephant's feed basket. Sayonara, satellite array. That was it. It took six of those and into the one bag. <sighs> okay, navigating in this map uh, is pretty shit. I just want that to be made very obvious. Yeah, getting all the balls in this one, I'm gonna need a guide. Sly, the insect in that pool is a rare Indian water bug. If you can carry it into Rajan's office, its wings will transmit local sound waves at a frequency I can monitor. Let me get this straight. We're gonna bug Rajan's office with a bug? It is an elegant plan, I agree. Now pay attention. That water bug can only survive in stagnant pools. If kept out of water too long, it'll become unhappy and likely draw the attention of local guards. Hmm. Looks like there's a few pools along the way to Rajan's office. 
A short swim every now and then should keep our little friend quiet. Okay. I go up there, all right. With this navigation, you've got to be... You're joking me, right? I'm trying to plan my route here, because I've got no clear indication of where I need to go. I'm going to have to plan my route ahead of time. This is, this is tough. I don't need these guys making it harder. It wouldn't be so bad if they didn't respawn. Okay, that mission was extra garbage. I got a feeling after these two missions, this place is crap. Oh, and there's the safe right there, so I got to make a mental note of this. Uh, luckily, it's all on recording, so I can just look back just in case. But uh, on the next episode, fuck this snake. Yeah, that that face of just like, really? Yeah, that's me right now. <laughs>